if you want to create a very special recycled instrument, I'll show you how you can build out of a normal plastic bottle a melodic percussion instrument, even a full marimba out of plastic bottles. We always called it the bottle rimba. For this, you just take the cap of the bottle. I just left it here on the bottle. You take the drilling machine and you make a small hole. Then it's very important that you take the sandpaper and then you glide over it, over this surface, because later we have to put the glue into that. Then this should be done on the inside too, because with the glue we have to make sure that there's absolutely no air coming out of the bottle, even with high pressure. So I do this in the inside too. So that it just has a, a better surface. Then I will put it back on the bottle and take a valve. That's just a normal bicycle valve. The only important thing is that you have a valve where you can control through this very finely how much air will go in or out because later we have to tune the bottle with this air. So I take this and put it in here. Oops. That's no problem, you will see later. Once it's filled with air, it will have the original form again. Then you open it again, and here we have to put now on the inside a very good glue, which can uh, kind of close the small hole which will rest there because later we will put a lot of air with a high pressure and the glue will make sure that there is no air coming out. So I do it here in the corner and you have to be careful that you still can move the inner part of the valve like this, and then to be absolutely sure, I'll do this on the other side too. I just wait a second until this is a little bit more solid. And I do this outside here too, and here to make sure that there's enough space here where we can put then later the pump and the air. So I do one outside here. If you want to be very sure, you make a second round. And then you just give the bottle a break for about a day or something until the glue, glue is really completely um, solid. And maybe I always put them like this on the bottle, then you can be sure that the inside here stays movable. Because when, you, when this is locked with the glue, then it's not so safe anymore. I have one here, what we prepared. And then you just take the pump, you open the valve, You put in some air, and now you already can hear. The more air I put in, the higher the instrument will be. One thing to tune the instrument is important to know the more air you put in, the more the instrument gets warmer. But then when you wait for a few seconds, the instrument cools down again for the room. And so the higher sound slowly is getting lower again. It's the same when we do the opposite. When I'm now starting to tune this bottle down, you can feel at your fingers how cold the air gets. And you heard it was a dum. Now when the surrounding heated it up again, it's getting back up. So this you have to know if you want to tune a full marimba. With this you can have a lot of fun. Either you play a solo on the bottle, on the table here, on the corner, with your hands, or you line them up and do a full marimba and have fun with your 
preferred melodies or harmonies with your bottle rimba. <laughs>